Hey everyone, it's the train freak again. So I was just going to let you know I'm back at Arkansas Traveler Hobbies in the old Missouri Pacific Depot in Bald Knob, Arkansas. And I was just going to show you since I didn't get a chance to show you last week a tour of the inside of the depot, but I thought I'd show you some other stuff as well. So before I show you that stuff, I always want to remind you to... And make sure you hit that bell button and shade in the notifications so that way you'll be able to get all future upcoming videos. Okay, so I'm going to zoom out. I am actually over here in the bald, bald knob. They have, you know, a few, a few pieces over here. I'm going to show you this one first. Now, I know it's in really rough shape. And we are in the process of trying to... Uh, renovate this car. This is a old RPO or railroad post office car uh, that was built in 1894 by the St. Charles Car Company out of St. Charles, Missouri, which eventually got bought out by American Car and Foundry or also known as ACF. Um, so this is just pretty much it. Um, it's, you know, originally wooden and it's like I said, it's in bad, rough shape, but that is why we're trying to renovate it. Uh, this car was operated by the St. Louis Iron Mountain and Southern Railway, which eventually got bought out by the Missouri Pacific. Uh, it is a wooden RPO, so when the RPOs got, or the wooden ones were no longer allowed to be on high-speed rail, then they went ahead and... Um, used it for local services only all right so other than that got a little bit of rail down here because from what i've been told he is still looking at getting a few more items and i'm going to walk away and you could probably see in my shot we've got a couple of cabooses and these are mopac cabooses uh, first one is a center cupola mopac number 11018 and then the other one that we have is a bay window style, uh, number 13675. So there's not many Mopac cabooses left. We are also in the process of renovating these as well. So a little bit of work, you know, involved, but hey, it's kind of what we're doing as far as like, um, you know, railway heritage you know trying to preserve these items because you just don't see these anymore now i don't know if you could really see it in this video but this mopac caboose here the center cupola used to have the big herald right there in the center and then they eventually went back to the eagle on the herald off to the side um, when we go back we're actually going to get uh, the jinx shop hopefully in north little rock which is union pacific uh, I think they're going to try to help us with this. So, all right. Well, here in a few minutes, I'm going to show you the inside. 